Hi all, in this video, I will show you how to create a pattern library in IC Validator. To create a pattern library, you need to have source patterns. You need to code a simple IC Validator run set with the pattern underscore learn function. IC Validator uses pattern underscore learn function to create a pattern library or update an existing pattern library with source patterns. The pattern underscore library underscore handle argument specifies the handle of a pattern library to be created or updated. The handle must be previously defined by the pattern underscore library function as shown. The pattern underscore library function defines the name and path of a pattern library. Define environment variables for pattern library path and pattern library name respectively. The pattern underscore layers argument lists the source pattern layers. The pattern underscore marker specifies the layer that contains polygons placed on each source pattern. The pattern marker specifies the location of interest such as the pinch and bridge locations of a lithographic hotspot or a DRC violation location. You will also need to specify pattern extent layer to define the boundary region of a source pattern. Pattern extent layer can be a user defined polygon layer specified by the pattern underscore extent argument or generated by the pattern underscore learn function through the match underscore ambit and ambit underscore mode arguments. I am writing the output from the pattern underscore learn function to an output gds file out.gds using write underscore gds function. You can also write it to an oasis file. To generate a pattern library, you need to provide the input design name, format, top cell or cell name of the design, and a run set file which includes the pattern underscore learn function. Type the following and execute. Once IC Validator run finishes successfully, the pattern library is generated as a directory in the specified library path under pattern underscore library function. Please check topcellname.layout underscore errors file for patterns that are successfully registered to the pattern library and for the patterns that fail to be registered due to invalid input along with their respective coordinates. Make sure that there are no invalid source patterns in the generated design. The pattern underscore learn function writes pattern information to a binary file named pattern.dat under pattern library directory. Also check the log text file under pattern library directory for the pattern library creation parameters and to get pattern statistics such as total number of unique patterns and total number of patterns generated. So this is how you create a pattern library in IC Validator. Thank you.